Alright, I'm not sure this strategy will work. Right now I'm set so that everyone has bomb, wind, and dark resist, but even then, the, these, these things have way too many different elements to call upon. Three different elements. Completely insane. Hmm. Buff ally attack. Haste everyone. Buff you up. Barrier. That was not enough to kill you, huh? Charged! Hmm. Still need to finish this guy off, but how? Hmm. What should I do? I can't dispel these guys easily. Damn it, no legs. He does have a dispel limit break, but I don't think it works well against them either. Shoot. Hmm. Ion Cannon. Could that be my ticket to victory? Hmm. Yes, I took care of one of them. Everyone out of the fence. Ow. See. Hmm. Swap no legs out. <sighs> Nine lives so that no one dies too easily. That's right, these guys will respawn based on your current weaknesses. That's exactly wh uh, why I have to get all these uh, 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 all these preparations ahead of time. Get in there, Matt. Damn it. This whole accuracy issue is kind of bullshit.
Unbelievable. Send in her re raise. Ow. Okay, key on everyone. Lance. Gah. Need to get everyone's evasion down somehow. Yes! How about you? Yes! One to one more! Charged! No, I will make a last stand! Crap. That did not work out. Everyone defend! We'll make our last stand next turn! Fortunately, Matt survived. Uh, Matt survived! Yes! That is exactly what happened! Okay, recast this on him. Go hit him again! There! All of them dead on Epic! If there was a second wave, I'd be screwed though. Play my prize. Just stuff I could buy at a shop with way less effort. Ugh. Okay, I guess I'll kill everything else here. All these less exciting looking foes. Yes. Okay, and this is gunpowder and titanium. Guessing I'm not gonna. Oh, there was treasure here. Whoops. Hmm. Okay, I guess I better take out this mammoth and see what's ahead. I hope- uh, they say there's supposed to be a triple zombie hydra somewhere in this area. Hmm. Okay, this next fight is going to be interesting. It's actually Chibi Knight in, in, in her strongest form. And I have to capture her. Of course I'll do that on zero difficulty, because generally it's just too much trouble to catch him on Epic. And I don't even get a medal for that. Whoa, that Chibi Nate thing is back and she's all decked out in some epic armor. It wouldn't fit me anyway, but maybe no legs? Over a million. That's a... Ugh, uh, and I already I have to take on a mammoth as well. Which means I'm gonna need some bomb resistance and earth resistance. She, she, and this one, she has multiple elements. Dark is her weakness, though. Hmm. How should I go about this? Alright, fight you for real this time. Protection. Attack up. Let's see. Barrier. Here it comes. Cursed. Oh, come on. She's an energetic little one. I'll give her that. Gah. Res no legs. Blessed Barrage. She absorbs holy, but we need we can't afford to have her too powerful. Hmm.
Ragnarok. Ow. No! Someone's gonna die. Knock it off, would you men, you men knight wannabe? This is really bad. Everyone gets a heal. Ugh. What should I do? Poison. Yeah, no one's just gonna die. Fire! Few days she went from being a scrub to an actual boss. Maybe soon she'll be an actual player character? Ugh. We are not in a good spot here. Blessed Barrage. Weekend. Let's see. Revive Lance again. Yeah. Temper. Even though he'll, he'll probably get killed again next turn. What's the barrage on War Mammoth? Dispelled. Uh, so no one died this time, but still. Ugh. See, I guess I better summon Ancient Monolith. Even when I uh, gu uh, guarded. Poison. Gah. No legs. Ragnarok again. Oh, 
Oh no. Almost got the man I've taken care of. Let's see. Cursed. Hungry. Oh, no. Can't be good. Why does that status effect even exist? Why does our group have such poor self control? Yeah. Got to swap out everyone. Spelled. Blessed Barrage. Can't let you get too powerful. Good timing with that heal. Nitro Blitz. Hmm, if she's by herself, maybe I should risk trying to capture her. Bad luck! She's gonna use- she, at least this time her, she's not gonna use her second turn for anything other than, uh, than defenses, I guess. That actually makes my life slightly easier. Bad luck. Gaia Blossom! Siphoned? That actually might not be good for me. She can command Mammoth so easily? I think we really underestimated her. How could she even summon them while she's siphoned? No way! Ugh, uh, this is really bad. We can. Gah. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to do that on uh, capture her on zero mode. This is ridiculous. Revive Matt so he gets the XP. Well, it doesn't matter since I'm going to reload anyways, huh? Seriously, that really sucks. Alright, reloading. I should capture her. On, on zero, of course. A lot of status effects stacked up. Her only weakness is that she is vulnerable to many status effects compared to previous bosses.
Hopefully there's no medal for specifically getting her on e uh, uh, on uh, epic. But yeah, none of these are none of these say capture on epic, just beat on epic, which is pretty easy. As long as you're patient and heal a lot. Yeah, I don't see anything here about capture on that pick. In fact, I don't think there's any more... I don't think there's any more medals for capturing stuff. Which means I'm just... There's actually no point capturing anyone anymore. Other than using them as summons. So what exactly does Chibi Knight do? It buffs the attack of all allies and then attacks a foe several times. Chooses a new target if the target dies. Kind of like Matt's Cleaver, but also with an attack buff. Instantly kills all foes. Doesn't that make them sup Doesn't that make the zombie Hydra superior to the Annihilate Limit Break? Other than, you know, it's really high co SP cost. Huh. This could be really useful against certain overleveled mobs. Yes, now you are boxed. You are in my bestiary. Aha! So, it's supposed to be some kind of Hydra. Yeah. Hold on, there's something I'd like to address for a second. Someone's been secretly following us for a very long time. What? Who's been following us? We've been somewhat careful. I've seen Matt talking to them, so he must be aware of it too. There's someone watching us from the sky, or from somewhere beyond. I can't explain it, but I can feel it. You can feel it too, Nats? I thought maybe I was a little bit crazy. I've always thought of them as the player controlling a game world. That's how I explained it to myself, anyway. There's many great minds that believe the world we live in is just a simulation, but I don't know if there's enough evidence to support such a claim yet. There may never even be a way to prove something like that. It's not so much I know the truth, I just have this gut feeling. I talk to myself sometimes just in case someone might be listening. Good things seem to happen to me when I explain my thoughts out loud, as if someone's listening to me and guiding me. Plus, there's all these little user interface elements floating around. Icons and speech bubbles and stuff like that. We don't need those. We can talk to them, to each other without them. They've gotta be there for someone else who's watching us from far away. How did I not notice the speech box before? It's so obvious now that I know what to look for. Well, anyway, I'd like to say something to that player behind the screen, or whoever that person is. I think they know us well enough so that we can be honest with them. You better look after us and make sure we don't die here! We've come a long way and it's getting really dangerous now. They've not always made the best decisions for us. There were times when I thought we wouldn't make it because we were being guided in the wrong direction. So if this is the end of our adventure, you better take it seriously. You know I'm going to send you to the, all those bonus dungeons later, right? Hey Nets, we don't want to make them angry or anything. If you let any of my friends get hurt, you'll have to deal with me. Alright, I'm done. I hope that message actually reached someone. I'm very confused here. I didn't know Mad and Nets were so religious. Smiles as if he knew about this all along. Healing items. Hmm. Better take care of these enemies first so I can grab the chest and then work on the Hydra in Epic Mode. Alright, that one had two monoliths and a bunch of machines. Turrets. Satan and Titanium. Hoping for more equipment, but no luck. I really should have done the bonus dungeons for shouldn't I? Alright, what's in these? Rare items. Alright, now to take on the these dragons. I need fire and dark and death, I think. Alright, how should I go about this? A million hit points each? Okay, we've defeated this boss before. It's got three heads now, but it's the exact same thing. Is it one level higher than me? Why? How? It's, are these guys scaling to my level? Because I'm... 35 is already pretty damn high. Gah. Fire spin. I'm not even sure it's worth putting on any 
defensive, uh, offensive buffs unless I'm ready to attack on the same turn. Uh. Of course not. Of course it wouldn't work. Swap out. What's it, Barrage? Oh come on! This is getting ridiculous. These fo uh, this these wear mechanics. There's no way to defend against this one, making it by far the worst weather uh, weather ever. At least with the airstrike mechanic, uh, uh, airstrike weather you could defend against it to some extent by uh, having bomb resistance. But here, no such luck. Ugh. Curses. What should I do? No matter what I do, I'm just gonna die. It's insane. Anything that could possibly be useful against them. Uh, Hyper Beam would not be very useful if he's just going to take too long to charge it. Crap. I just feel like I don't have m many options at all. Hmm. What to do here? Yeah... They, they really... Seriously, I hope they're not... This isn't actually a level scaled battle. It's really messed up when the enemy scales higher than you. Hi. Limit. The creator. I'm not sure I actually summoned this one yet. Not bad, I guess, but we're still a long way from actually winning. Gah. I need to use fire spin again. Limit break. Not that's gonna do me much good here, is it? Ah.
crap. <sighs> what to do here? I still can't recast Protect. I wonder if there's a way to reduce my cooldowns without having to eat items. Hmm. What can I even do against them? Summon Ancient Monolith. You're kidding me! Even that one shot me. Buff you. Not that it's gonna help much. Annihilate is pretty much worthless. I guess Mighty Oak. Better than nothing. Ah. Do not- No! Oh, good, good, you didn't kill it yet. I would've been pissed if you did. Oh no. Berserk! Damn it! And now at least uh, uh, limit break has still not activated yet. Uh. What exactly can I do here? Summon. Dare I use a Viking monolith just to give myself a slight advantage? Blessed Barrage. Combo shot. Uh. I don't want to. I want to make my moves carefully here. Hmm. There's no point doing an offensive buff unless I attack in the same turn, huh? Let's see. Let's just defend for now. Auto revive! Oh no! Ah! Curse you! Bullet hell! You've gotta be shitting me.
Triple death. It's over. The path to the final boss has been cleared. At least I think it is. I'm gonna just go take a peek. Stop, we can't go this way. Something's very wrong over there. Uh, we don't have a choice, but I'm gonna save just in case. I feel like my body's being pulled forward against my will. I don't want to go- I don't want to go this way anymore. Meow! What the? Meow? Space itself is being cracked and twisted beyond recognition. If this corruption spreads, the fabric of all space and time could disintegrate into nothingness. It's as if the world itself is being deleted and shredded. What are we even supposed to do here? Is this the end? How do we fight something like this? I could have stayed home and lived a little, a little longer in blissful ignorance. Let's go back and do that, guys. I don't want to be swallowed by the void. Meow! It's all just a nightmare. It's all just a nightmare. It's all just a nightmare. It's all just... Hey, snap out of it! We've come so far together. It'll pull through if we do our best. Each one of us is as powerful as any foe we've encountered so far. That person behind the screen is going to guide us to victory. I can feel it. We're not alone in this fight either. We've got a huge supporting cast of creatures to back us up. There's tons of people back in Hope Harbor, Greenwood Village, and Red Pine Town all rooting for us. We can't let them down. If this is our final battle, I'm going to make it count. But I'd be lying if I said I wasn't terrified. Mom and Dad would never forgive me if I lost here. I have to win for them, and for everyone else. If I'm going to go down, I'll make it as painful for our enemy as possible. I'll detonate every bar I've got left. It's been fun traveling with you all, and it would be nice if we could keep doing it. I suppose I'll try hitting it with my sword. That seems to have worked so far. Now! Yikes. Any f miscellaneous stuff I can grab here? For now, let's just head back and make preparations. Kill off all the bonus bosses and steal their treasures. Maybe, maybe something there will give me the edge I need. I just hope I don't have to refight the bone dragon every time I come through here. God damn it. Everyone's still corrupted. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this Let's Play of Epic Battle Fantasy V, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.